What's up my friends and fellow subscribers, Buffer Kid back again on my channel for another video. Uh, as many of you know, I use, I usually run Sony equipment in my setup. And as you've probably seen in some of my videos and of course my earlier videos, I use this receiver right here. Now this is the Sony STR-SE591 5.1 surround sound unit. It was manufactured back in 2001 by Sony Corporation. Now if you remember from my one of my earlier videos, I believe it was my third video where I talked about this unit. Uh, this was basically given to me by my brother because, well, his house wasn't wired correctly because this unit requires so much power to run and his house wasn't wired so I had, I had took it and I hooked it up and it worked just fine and I currently used it for all playbacks for DVD playback for Blu-ray playback and then stuff off my computer and for my gaming consoles. Well, I've decided that it's time to go ahead and retire this unit. You know, this had built-in Dolby Digital and Digital DTS decoders. Yep, yeah, it was a pretty good unit. I'm going to miss this. You know, it's a great 5.1 unit. Now, a lot of you are probably thinking, you know, well, Buffer Kid, what do you do now? You know, you don't have a 5.1 unit anymore. Well, you would be right on that. I do not have a 5.1 unit anymore. I have since upgraded to this new unit right here. Now, this is a brand new unit. This is the Sony STR-DH710 High Definition Audio Video Control Center Receiver. Now, what this has, this has six HD inputs. It has three HDMI inputs and three component video inputs as well as composite video inputs two optical inputs as opposed to the three optical inputs that were on the old on the SE591 so yeah I've cut my inputs down some now, I picked this up at Best Buy this was for I picked this up for two hundred and thirty nine dollars this was a demonstrator model this is 3D high definition ready and 3D blu-ray ready right out of the box this one has built-in Dolby True HD and DTS HD master audio decoders so what that will mean now is my Blu-ray player, which as many of you have seen, the Sony BDPS 360, uh, used to decode and then would transmit it into 5.1 to the to the other Sony receiver. But now the receiver has will take over that via HDMI. Now the way this is hooked up now, of course, my cable box and my Blu-ray player are all hooked up into my high def via HDMI and my HD TV and my 360 are hooked up by optical video inputs and the DVD, my 5 disc DVD player down there is hooked up via coaxial and the only downside to this when I bought this it did not come with a remote so I'm and the original remote that comes with it in order for me to order one I would have to order it through Sony and that would cost me 26 bucks so I just went ahead and I picked up this remote right here today. This is the uh, the Sony Remote Commander. This is the model number RMVZ320. Now, basically, this is pre-programmed right out of the box from Sony. I picked this up for about for 20 bucks today at Best Buy. Now, what this is all pre-programmed for Sony equipment right out of there. So all you, all I would have to done, which I did, was just point it at the unit, and it would sync up directly with any unit. So now it's synced up to to my old CRT Sony television, the DVD player, and then this new unit here. Now this unit here is 700 watts, and it's a 7.1 channel. It is S Air ready, which means Sony's S Air speaker system will hook right into this without any problems at all, and will work just perfectly. So far, I've I've used this unit. I've got this all hooked up since last night. I've used this unit. I love it. It's very great doesn't seem like it draws a lot of power which is good because with the old unit whenever I powered it on I could see my lights flicker which told me it drew a lot of power but with this one I hardly ever noticed that so yep so if you're in the market for a good high definition receiver 7.1 channel or 5.1 channel you know definitely look look into Sony for for a receiver of course uh, if you like me and you want to just upgrade to get the full experience of Blu-ray in their multiple audio formats, their looseless audio formats such as Dolby True HD and DTS HD Master Audio. 
I would totally recommend picking up this unit. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. And, uh, and also, uh, a couple quick pickups here. Uh, uh, went to GameStop, uh, picked up a couple games here for my, for my PSP. I picked up a couple used games here. I picked up R-Type Command for the, for the uh, Sony PSP. And then Afterburner, Black Falcon. Very cheap games here, you know. A couple bucks, you know. Couldn't pass them up. So, dying to play both of these because I love I love these games. So uh, I love these these type of shmup shooters and then, of course, fighter jet based games. So, yeah. But once again, guys, uh, thanks for watching, everybody. And this is Buffer Kid saying, be cool and see ya.